Praxis and I'm back on site today for day 600. Today's the 600th day since we started the series. Uh, I remember at day 500 I was sort of speculating like 100 days in the future would probably be in or had a good chance of being in and we're not but you know we're, we're really close. Uh, once we finish sheathing the outside of the house all that's left uh, you know in you know, putting the chimney on the roof uh, you know once we finish with this outside stuff all that's left is doing the electrical stuff, putting in the electrical receptacles and the switches, uh, which will take, I don't know, less than a week probably once we're focused on that. We have to have the plumbers come in for one more day to just fix their leaks. Uh, and I have to add some handrails to the stairs uh, per building code. Everything else is done. So we are within spitting distance of getting in there, you know, as long as we can get all this outside stuff done. And we've had, a, as you know, a lot of really good days to do it. The ladybugs are gone today. It was just like a one day event. It's still comfortable outside, but not quite as hot. And, you know, it's nice to not be being bit by ladybugs. Uh, and what I'm doing today is just more taking advantage of. If you look uh, to your left behind you, I had a lot of boards that I did in the last two hours of yesterday. Uh, you know, normally we would head home around like 4.30 or so, five o'clock. Uh, river was cool to stay for longer. So I was just here for two hours, just ripping out boards, uh, grabbing them from over there, giving them a, um, a single coat of seal and putting it over here so they could dry today. Uh, last night was the last night uh, for a little bit that it was safe to leave things out knowing that it wasn't gonna rain. So I got a bunch of it all laid out. This morning, I've uh, put up some more boards in the back. I've started putting some boards on the front. We're almost up to where the windows start in the front. In fact, uh, all the boards have their first coat of seal. And I've got them laid out uh, here on the ground. These are two 14-foot boards, this and this, uh, that are gonna go up in the front. Here's another 12-foot board. These all have one coat of seal. Uh, again, I've got the single coat of seal here, double coat of seal over there. Uh, and um, I'm really trying to kind of uh, you know, lay things out and kind of organize things so I can get the best use out of the wood. One thing that I'm doing as I go uh, is uh, I mentioned we're almost up to the windows in the front of the house. And once I get to the windows, it's all short boards. There's a short board on top of the windows. Uh, there's a short board between the two windows and then the short, uh, short board b uh, beneath the lower run of windows. I label those A, B, and C on here and I measured how um, long each of those boards needs to be when I get over there. And what I've been doing as I've been, uh, you know, prepping boards and creating scrap uh, as I've been measuring the scrap and see if it qualifies to be an A, a B, or a C so that I can, you know, get the best use out of the scrap that I'm creating. Uh, so far, things are pretty good. In fact, the scrap that we've generated is pretty much just what's on the ground here, just little short pieces. So things have been going pretty good, uh, you know, along those lines. And, uh, you know, it's still early part of the day today, and I think we've got a good shot of getting an awful lot of boards up on the house today. We can't leave stuff out tonight because we're going to be getting rain, uh, but we'll be inside, maybe starting on that electrical work tomorrow. Unless, you know, the weather forecast clears up and maybe we do do some boards outside. You know, we're staying nimble, jumping between, you know, uh, you know, what's possible to do and what's most important. And today the most important and the most possible is boards. That's it. Thanks for watching.